Hi, I'm Leslie Dellery, and you're watching Being Millennialish. On today's episode, we are taking to the streets. A recent study in the UK revealed that 26% of millennials would date a robot if they were their perfect match and looked like a human. So we're here today to find out, do New Yorkers agree and would they actually date a robot? Would you ever consider dating a robot? Absolutely not. I don't think so. No? no. I don't think so. <laughs> no, I need like a real human with like flaws, like they don't have to be perfect, but yeah, I think a robot is a little creepy. I don't think so, no. No? Why not? <laughs> because it, it's not really dating, like, I don't know. That's it'd feel like it'd be too perfect. Yeah. Would you date a robot? Would it act like a human? Uh, it would act like a human. It would be your perfect match, but it would just be technology. That's a tough question. Well. Well, I think it'll depend on two things. Where I am in life. Okay. If I've been divorced and I'm struggling and I, I just can't deal with life anymore, <laughs> would... I'd opt out for a robot because okay. it's... You don't want to... Nowadays, no. I feel like dating has become something so quick where you just meet somebody and you date right away. Or like there's Tinder, there's, there's so many different ways to start approaching dating. Yep. So if there's a robot out there, why would I go through swiping left and right and all that nonsense? I could just date a robot and get it over with and, and potentially be more happier than spending all that time finding the perfect match. It's like if you know there's a perfect job for you, why would you sit there and look for other jobs when someone's already offering you something that's what you need? Why not? Because they can't reproduce. So what's the point? That's true. What if you could make something wrong with the robot? So, because it's your perfect match, so maybe your perfect match needs to have a little bit of drama. I guess. <laughs> would you be afraid of the robot being more perfect than you? Like, would you be afraid that it would make you feel worse about yourself? No, because I accept myself for who I am. And I feel like the people that would be offended by a robot being better than them would have self like insecurity issues and like would not be self-aware with about about their weaknesses and their strengths. I guess if I have no way of telling if it's a human or a robot, like why not? But yeah, otherwise I need like someone real. I mean, it'd be great for home attendance, I guess, if that if that's the. So you get a <laughs> cleaning or some sort of I a, guess so, yeah. a home assistance robot. Okay. Yeah. Do you have any friends that you think would date robots? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Why do you think they date them? Because they have no luck with real women. <laughs> but if she can provide me some sort of supreme level of love that other people won't give me, then why not? Right? You know, they say like motherly love is like up there, and then it goes like your girlfriend and friends. Your ideal is motherly love. I'm a mama's boy, so, okay. so yeah. So okay. I've always been a mama's boy. Yeah, you yeah. wouldn't want to kind of go to a lab, create your perfect person, and then. Um. I don't think so because then it's like everything is so expected, like what you think you want or need and like you don't, there's no surprise or like spontaneity to it, so yeah. I think maybe it's the future. I don't like it, but maybe it's yeah. coming. It's yeah. coming soon. Do you have any uh, female friends that you think would date robots as well? No. You think mostly male? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If I can break, I mean, yeah, maybe, you know, maybe I will. If I'm right, right now, 20 years old, <laughs> bring me a robot right now and I'll date her. I'm ready to go. And and if I have a robot and she'll understand me and she's perfect, then she'll be like, all right, he has to do his thing. He has to make money. Please, you know, please, if you can make her. So now you've convinced yourself that I you're ready, myself, you're ready yeah. to date a robot. Yeah, I'm ready to date a robot. Awesome. I'm, I'm more than ready. There you have it. Doesn't sound like New Yorkers quite agree about dating a robot, but let us know what you think and comment on my page, even if you're a robot.